Hello students, as you can see the question, it's from 3D and this is question number 23 from Exemplar. Just see the question carefully. If the plane AX plus PY equals 0 is rotated about its line of intersection with another plane Z equals 0 through an angle alpha, then prove that the equation of the plane and its new position is ax plus by plus minus under root of a square plus b square into tan alpha into z equals to zero. Now, the language is quite confusing. But if you read it again, then the plane ax plus by equals to zero, when it is rotated, that is, it is making an angle of alpha with its line of intersection. So what is the line of intersection? That is one plane plus lambda times or any constant times the other plane equals to zero. So ax plus by is equal to zero is making an angle alpha with its line of intersection and that is not z is equal to zero. That is ax plus by plus lambda times z is equal to zero. So the angle between the two planes is alpha and the target is that whatever is given, whatever expression is given to us, we have to prove that. So we hope that you got the idea. If not, then we can solve it uh, together. Yeah. So one plane is plus by is equal to zero and the line of intersection is is our concern is equation number one and equation number two now angle between them is alpha so what are the d ratios of first plane d ratios of the normal to the first plane normal to the first plane say a1 is to b1 is to c1 and that is a is to b is to zero what about the d ratios of the normal to second plane so they are A is to uh, B is to lambda. Now, angle between them is, angle between the two planes is alpha. So, we'll now apply the angle between the two planes and we'll use the D ratios of the normal of respective planes. So, we get, uh, we know the formula. So, applying the formula. cos alpha is a1 a2 so that is a into a plus b1 b2 plus c1 c2 and that is 0 into lambda divided by under root of a1 square plus b1 square plus 0 square into under root of a square plus b square plus lambda square so now when we simplify we get The target is to get a lambda, which is very simple. For that, we, ne we need to do squaring. You 
can cancel and we can cross multiply open it up Keeping lambda square cos square alpha on one side and transforming uh, the other terms to the right hand side we get. Furthermore, so what is 1 minus cos square theta? That is a sine square theta. So, sine square alpha so what is lambda square and what is lambda taking two values and by getting lambda we can straight away put this in equation number two which was uh, the required uh, uh, equation of the plane we get now putting this in Look, so initially it was looking a damn difficult question but by carefully analyzing and having patience, by reading it again, one could easily frame and can get the answer. So all the very best. Thank you very much.